Hello and welcome to the third video of this. I'm just saving paper and keeping it all the same. We're at video C and we're doing number 47. Um, I already have things written here because I started this video earlier and then I had to delete it because my dog was going crazy. Anyway, number 47 says convert each degree measure to radians and if applicable round to the nearest thousandth. Okay, um, this is much like number 11 really if not exactly. So I have 4.25 degrees and I'm going to multiply it by my converter uh, 2 pi over 360 and it says I can round and so here I'll bring that up a little bit. So I know I'm going to round off pi 2 at some point. Um, go ahead and multiply that 42.5 times 2 times pi all divided by 360 and your calculator will give you 0 0.74176, okay? Now, because we are rounding, I'm gonna make this kind of a squiggly line like that. We are approximating. And that, of course, now is in radians, okay? Now, uh, just as a shortcut note, instead of 2 pi over 360, um, others like to do um, just pi over 180, which is totally, totally fine, okay? Uh, pi over 180 degrees also works. You'll get the exact same answer, 0 0.7417 seven six all right oh whoa slow down manny it says round to the nearest thousandth this thousandth place is there's a tenths the hundreds and the thousands so i have to cut this off and because this is a seven it's going to add one more to here and my final 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 answer is going to be zero point Seven, four, two. There we go. All right, on to the next one.